You know, I don't know what kind of cops you think we are in Clue. I was just curious, you know. I've been cordial with you and you've been No, afraid. you were running you've my play. Afraid. What's the penal code for biking while black? I'm not aware of that statute. On the evening of January 24th, 2021, Extra Good Citizen and I were documenting police activity. As soon as we entered the Brazosport area, the police immediately started making secret phone calls. This Lake Jackson officer mostly kept well below the speed limit, but he initially stopped past the white line. LJPD would have used that for probable cause to stop someone that met a profile, but I moved on. Are they about to do Wait, can you show me out of the intersection of Hardy and Smith with Amanda G? In Clute, an officer made a subject stop on a woman he already knew by name. I arrived on scene in less than two minutes. The officer left her alone soon after I arrived. I initiated traffic enforcement while John interviewed the victim. Uh huh. Mm -hmm. That I'm following two of them. They were going to do a subject stop on a guy. They're splitting up. One's going back towards town on Old Angleton Road. I'm following the main guy. He's in car 841. I'm following him north on Old Angleton Road. After learning the nature of the stop, I wanted to interview the officer, but he made a sudden U-turn to evade me. He then pursued me. Charles Young. Henry Charles Young. They're running me. Hey, John, they're running me. Clute's running me. Coming up to, I'm, I'm by the school coming, I'm on the high school about to get on Dick. Was it your plate? Yes, it was my plate. Okay, 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 okay. I'm on main. I'm heading that way. I, I'm about to be on. I'm gonna be. I'm gonna be taking a left onto Dixie. Okay. Okay. When the police run your license plate or ask for your identification, you have nothing to gain. The police do it to see if they can arrest you or at least impound your vehicle. You don't get a tax rebate or lottery ticket. There is no reward. Things can get only worse for you. They won't get any better. Since I knew I was being investigated, I made sure not to give him anything. What's your name? Officer Schmeezing. What's your badge number? 218. What's your probable cause? For what? For running my plate, asshole. So they ran your plate. It's said that Blue Lion government employees won't come clean and admit the truth. Maybe he missed the memo that I was in town. 205 218. I'm trying to public service you again. The Kloot police continued their shakedown of everyone brave enough to be out after dark. I can't please show wings over Texas. For suspicious circumstances. Kloot actually does a very good job compared to He looks like a good guy. You think, Why but do you they this? do whatever they want to do. If they're stopping you, they're seeing if they can bring you to jail right near. They're not here to help you. You don't have to talk to the police. Hey guys, we're at Clute, Texas at Plantation and Lazy Lane. And this guy right here was just running my plates for no reason, just out of the blue. Trying to be a super tyrant, a total tyrant. And now he's stopping these people right here trying to bring them to jail. He just goes around shaking down people who aren't doing anything criminal. Super tyrant right here. Sergeant was laughing a second ago. You ever seen that show Cheater? I'll, I'll always, every time, every time I go somewhere. Oh my 
Yeah, guys. So he's too much. He, he's too much of a girl to just admit that he did it. He goes, "Who said uh, I ran your play?" Oh no, that's my that's my baby mama. Oh, no, no, we're he wouldn't with just it. be a man tag and admit me. it. Who said I did that? Hey, can you guys tag me in this. Um, it's on. Oh, are you on Facebook? I think he's on Brazoria County Scanner on Facebook. I actually forgot to start that. Oh. You didn't have to remind him. Are, hey, are you watching it? Are you recording this too? I mean, should we be recording this? You should record all interactions with the police in case they put a lie report in. You should absolutely record it. You can just say no, I'd like to go about my day. He's being pretty invasive here. Yeah, no, I was in the Wolfville, you know. I was doing really well. And then it's none of his business. Well, kind of like phone skills. If he had phone skills, he probably wouldn't have ran my plates illegally. Honesty's not high with this one. Hey, give me my phone, man. I'm gonna support you. John, are you still... Yeah, you're not wanting to talk around the police anymore? I'm not a You're doing... Is vertical what we're supposed to do now? Is film oh, vertically? I'm, I'm streaming live on Facebook. Really? I'm supposed to do vertical now. <laughs> no, you always hold it the other way. Don't hold it like I am right now. He's being a bad influence. Yes. Hold it, you gotta hold it the other Holy. way. And then Barbara. Extra Dang. good citizen on YouTube. Please like, share, and subscribe. Sergeant, what is your name? Garcia. Garcia? Yes, sir. Did you hear how many phone calls Angleton got? No, sir. You had heard anything about Angleton? No. Just the video. <laughs> What'd you think of the video? Would you have made that arrest? Not gonna. Come on, it's not even your department. You can comment on it. Would you have arrested me? I'm not going to comment. No. Yeah, it was a crap arrest. <laughs> Blink once if it was a crap arrest. Blink twice. Hey, man, they got... I'm, you know, just... You know. What's that? Are you on? <laughs> oh, bitch! Um, listen. Is it going to be a warning? Yes, sir. Oh, no, dude. Oh, uh, Yes. Yes. So good. Yeah. Oh, I've been there when they fracked. When they fracked. What do you, have? you guys are offshore here, right? Uh, no. documenting but this guy's offering me a job. I don't know what you guys think about him, but he's offering me an um, appointment. Let's put that in there, Brazoria County, whatever the fuck y'all got going on. I'll be uh dude's cool as hell. I'll be in touch with you uh, on the uh, Woodstock. Yeah. I know that they picked up workout. I mean it's out west. Yeah, uh, I mean two weeks on, two weeks off. I'm just there and then go home. You know how that's 
Thank you, man. I appreciate you guys. You guys are awesome. These cops have done me well. They're respectful. I don't know what y'all got going on with y'all's little documentary or whatever, but these guys are cool and they offered me a job. How many minutes till Uber gets here? Officer Sleazy was collecting very detailed information on this man. Police often lie to gather information. The reason police identify people is to arrest them if possible. It's common for someone to have an unpaid traffic ticket or other warrant. You don't have to thank someone who is searching for a reason to harm you, even if they address you in a courteous tone. Good. I heard some stuff. Is it true? Yeah, I got, they arrested me. Did you what see the video? Happened? No, I didn't. Oh. I didn't watch it. So, um, basically doing exactly what I'm doing here. Uh-huh. Angleton decided they had enough of me and arrested me, so. Yeah. Don't know. I got uh, I'm, uh. What was the charge for? Uh, interfering with public duty. Oh, really? Like you were too close or what? Uh, no, they... Mm -hmm. I mean, you don't have to... Yeah, no, you no, I'm just to. trying to think of what I... Because I'm live. I don't want to say... You know, I, I didn't do it. I, it, it you, I, I want you to watch the video, uh -huh. and then the next time I see you, we'll talk about it. <laughs> it, I, it just, was, uh, I, was, I heard that you got arrested for something, and I was like, for real? Yeah. So I didn't. I don't want to speculate anything. I don't want to... Mm -hmm. I was like, okay, but now that I see you, I was like, okay. Yeah, they, and then he was following me, and it was weird because you've never followed us like that before. Mm -hmm. Well, so, I have to, I have to change up my tactics now. Yeah. So I, I really do because. Uh, so that's why you're in my plate. Um, so I was like, just like that was strange, you know. Mm -hmm. And I mean, it's no big deal. You know how we operate. Yep. So no, you guys have always, uh, you've done, never give me any problems. Yeah. So. That's cool. I mean, I don't know why your guy's got a problem with me. Well, he's a little upset because we have, you know, we obviously we, we can hear the radio traffic. Yeah. And when he hears his play come you, over you, the radio, you could have just answered my question, and um, you and you didn't. I don't need a probable cause to run a plate. I don't need it. I need probable okay, cause. Okay, then to why did you run contact. it? Just just why did you run it? So, What's the point of doing that? Why? Um, that was my question. Just answer it. Well, the way you were following me, is that? Is that I mean, it's a two-way street, right? I'm not harassing you. I'm not giving you a hard time. What about the you woman who is on the public street? The what? The woman on the public street, or is that someone else? What about her? What's she doing? I can't stop and talk to people? But she, she told us she said to uh, get off the streets and go home. Yeah, I did. She was trying to, uh, she, she actually had, she well, didn't have any shoes. She was sitting in the middle of the street whenever I pulled up. Well, or, she didn't have any shoes. Well, here's why so. she did that, because that, 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 that uh, the people had set out some gar uh, right. trash, yeah. and there were some shoes in there, and she needed some shoes. Right. And that's why she was sitting down. She was actually trying on the shoes. No, she, yeah, she had the, <laughs> some all. stilettos on. Yeah. I, told, I said, Amanda, you need to take those things out before you break your ankle. Yeah, no, she was just, but, trying, to, she was just trying to get a pair of shoes no, that's it. to go home. So, I mean, so. it ain't nothing wrong with stopping out and talking to people. Mm -hmm. You know, I don't know what kind of cops you think we are in Clue, but... No doubt. We're not like, well, I have an idea of how most of them are, but I just, I just don't understand hey, why you ain't know, just telling. You are, uh, you're, you're following me, okay? I maybe I thought I did something wrong. I don't know. And I don't think that that's unreasonable. You know how you guys are a little jumpy. Well, around. Rosenberg runs my plate about once, sometimes five times a day. I was thinking if today is the time yeah. when maybe midday my insurance expired or someone else put a warrant on me, right. and they're not very good cops. So that tactic. Rosenberg when when people do that, no, they're not very nice. So when I hear that, that, yeah. that kind of sets alarm bells off that I might be dealing with someone who's a little aggressive. What's your name, first name? Well, you know, if you would have just came up and asked me, then well, we would have had no issue. We're having a conversation. But you're trying to do all this computer database stuff. Good luck with your computer database. What are you talking about? Good luck with the computer database. Well, I was just curious, you know. I've been cordial with you, and you've been... No, afraid. you were running you've my plate. Afraid. You were running my plate to see if you hey, could John. pull me over on okay, a warrant right. or whatever else, no insurance, impound my truck. Come on. Do you think I was born yesterday? I know why y'all do that. Oh, the irony of the police crying about someone following them. They routinely follow drivers looking for pretexts to attack members of the public. The Big Brother Surveillance State empowers police to gain personal details, including the residence address, of anyone they see on the road. Yet state law allows police to hide where they live. Government does not work for the people. We are merely cash cows for the ruling class. John and I continued our patrol. We passed two people on bikes. Even though they were in no way suspicious, 
I expected Clute to shake them down. This video is in real time. Now these people might be worth keeping an eye on. Well, I don't know, there's an officer, all right. Is that one? It looks like someone's being sneaky. Sure, okay. That was, uh, that was me letting the sergeant know that y'all are f***ing with me. And I don't like it. Mm-hmm. Two, uh, two subjects stopped. We'll be at both the high schools. Five and block. East Main. The sergeant immediately pulled them over. He did not first observe their activity. Clute stopped them 30 seconds after we passed the cyclist. The officer had been in service from his previous call for only 24 seconds before the stop. You're gonna, I'm going to have to let you out. Okay. Oh, maybe there's a point left by this. Um, Just this park on the side of the road. I'm not going to park behind him, not on this road. Mm. Okay, okay, okay. Hey. Because they're blocked. Like, That's why. Can I get in here? Yep. Okay. Bullshit, dude. Get out, get out, go. I told you you would do that. Mm -hmm. Run, 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 run. I'll be right behind you. Okay. I'm a cop watcher. I watch cops. Uh, um, I'm here for your safety. Okay, it's fine. I just had the egg. Mm-hmm. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, I guess I need to do something about that. Just going down the street. Exactly. Just going down the street, man. Why you gotta do that? To be honest, my homegirl just got pulled over, and I, I had said, "Why you gonna go down the street like you normally do? Mm -hmm. You gonna get pulled, get pulled over. over?" I seen, we seen you. We knew it was coming. Yeah, this is my partner. Don't worry, he's, he's, he's my partner. See, you don't, you don't. What's the penal code for biking while black? I'm not aware of that statute. Can you edify me on that? Johnny, you won't help me. Do you know that statute? Biking while black after night? I'm not sure. I, I know I saw the statute right down the street. I thought that was illegal uh, for the, the government, not the, the citizen. Until they're arrested, they don't have to let them know who they are. Correct. I get you. I get you. Wait. I told you, Clute was bad news, John. Yeah. What was what was the probable cause for stopping them? Oh, you got plenty of lights. There's lights all over. They're doing this because they want to take you to jail. That's the only reason they would stop you and ID you because they want to destroy you tonight. They want to take you out. You do not have to identify for driving a bike while black. I would just not I would shut the heck up if it were me. John and I are trying to get lawsuits going, so we're talking. But they're trying to take y'all out. Hey guys, this is Clute, Texas. We're on uh, Main Street. Uh, 
between Old Angleton Road and Shank Street. Food has been on fire tonight and not in a good way. So if y'all missed my last one, uh, they were just running my plate to try to, to get me a minute ago, about 20 minutes ago. And then when I initially called the officer on it, he, he oh, who, who said uh, your plate was what I said? And then finally he came clean, he, he said because I was following him. Most people don't know what the police actually do. As we witnessed in Clute, the police were going around messing with people who were doing nothing wrong. A woman in need trying to reuse clothing. A journalist documenting the official acts of government employees. A man and a woman waiting for Uber instead of driving while possibly intoxicated after a night out. And a couple traveling down the street on bicycles lit up like Christmas trees. What was the need for police intervention in any of these circumstances? The police didn't even observe the people before moving in to harass them. How is this making anyone safer? I don't know what this reporter is doing on the phone. That's kind of interesting. Do y'all know what all this stuff is? Racial profiling stuff? I don't know. He's doing it so fast. Answering a lot of questions. I guess they put the racial profiling data in on their ticket rider. Is that what they're doing? This is Clute, Texas Police Department. These people are doing nothing suspicious. They're just traveling down this road. We have video of what they were doing prior to the stop. And I can tell you that the police observed them for no more than maybe five seconds. You don't have to thank them for trying to destroy you. Many people mistakenly believe that the police are out identifying and stopping crime. The reality is that they use pretext traffic stops or unjustified subject stops to shake people down. These are people just going on about their day, and they often fit certain profiles. Most people, uneducated about their rights, voluntarily stop and show their papers. But these Gestapo tactics are un-American. True patriots exercise their constitutional rights. And the police might violate your rights, so be sure to always film the police. Thank you for watching. So this is what I do in Rosenberg. I go and I find the people mm -hmm. who they're gonna pull over, <laughs> mm -hmm. and then you I call that them, one, and then I and I do that, and I wait back, and as soon as they get into the stop, I head up. Mm -hmm. Dude, you called that one. I mean, you know, I don't know what kind of cops you think we are. Clue.